Good afternoon, it's your man Earl. We are once again uh, traveling, and today is day uh, 243, August uh, 31st, Friday. It's about, uh, well, sun is about to go down, it's late in the evening, and uh, here we are once again uh, traveling, and today's subject matter is, uh, my nose is running allergies, kicking my tail here. See if I can't grab some tissue right quick. Uh, today is day 243 Friday. And today's subject matter is uh, flexible finance. Flexible finance. All right. Flexible finance. And uh, one of the things that we want to do in business is we want to create relationships to where we can be and have flexible financing. Now, whenever you hear flexible financing, typically you think about, uh, you know, these creative strategies to buy things. And that's true. That's part of flexible financing. But I also want to give you the other side. All right. Flexible financing is also your ability to be flexible in how you pay things. There's two sides to that. And you earn those things by being a person of integrity, by being a person of your word, and by paying your bills on time to the best of your ability. It's not just enough to be flexible when you are buying things. That's the easy part, right? Because people are always in the business to sell, selling buildings, selling cars, selling things of value. And typically, the more expensive they are, people are be willing to be more flexible because they understand how tough raising money or getting loans, et cetera, et cetera, can be. But you want to work on your flexible financing and how you pay things. Because guess what? You're going to have down times. You're going to have up times. You're going to have times when you are going to need to redirect or recalibrate how you are spending resources. And so you want to have the ability to be flexible on how you pay things. Okay. Uh, I'll give you just one of them and the video will be over with. Once again, day 243, flexible financing, right? Or flexible financials. Here's one way, all right? Most of the time, people want to get paid on a monthly basis, but you need to be able to have the ability to pay things on a quarterly basis. Now, yes, does that create a higher level of accountability? Yeah, because guess what? People are waiting a little longer for their money, but if you have the credibility and you earn the ability to pay on a quarterly basis, it also helps you free up your ability to use cash flow to build and expand other areas in your business. All right? It's your man, Earl. Day 243, August 31st, traveling once again Friday, uh, flexible financing or flexible financials, all right? Learn how to earn the ability to be flexible, not just how you buy things, but also how you pay off things, all right? Be responsible. Day 243, it's your man Earl. Peace.